Tough on everyone. Yeah, um, obviously you don't want to lose. Uh, I mean, it was the end of a great season. Uh, what a great group of guys, but uh, uh, compliment to Texas Tech, they had a great team. Uh, they had a great game, and they were just able to put out tonight. What did they do specifically to take you guys out of your rhythm? Uh, they have an amazing defense. Um, I think uh, they stuck to what they normally do. You know what I'm like I said, they were uh, top two defense in the country, and uh, it's what makes them so good. So um, being able to stick to their principles and whatnot, they were able to uh, you know, execute on the defensive end and uh, also make trust on the offensive end, and they were able to uh, I mean, execute the other game. How do you look back on this season now? I know it's, it's early, but how yeah, do you look back on it? I mean, it was an amazing season. Uh, we had the best start in Michigan history, 17-0, and uh, we won 30 games. We well, only lose seven. Um, obviously, it's not the way we wanted to end, but uh, it's still an amazing season. What a great group of guys. I mean, of course, obviously, the current moment and the feeling is not something you want to feel, but as a, at the end of the day, in the overall outlook, we had an amazing season. A lot of you guys return next season. Um, does that excite you a little bit? I mean, how can you guys kind of learn from this next year? Um, last year when we lost it, a lot of a lot of guys were left. Um, now we have a lot of guys who are returning. Like you said, so, I mean, uh, we'll lock in and we'll obviously have to give us fuel and everything. And, um, you know, so we'll go into the off season ex uh, extremely excited and ready to play and uh, just trying to see if we can just accomplish something like this amazing group. What was that moment like with Charles there? What did you say? Yeah, bro, I mean, I wouldn't be in the situation I'm in right now without Charles. Um, he's helped me through so much freshman year. He's, he's, he's an amazing person, I guess, my big brother, and being able to, to look up to someone like that is, uh, it's, it's, uh, I couldn't have a better brother. What do you take from us? <laughs> from what, the loss? Man? Yeah. Can we learn something from us? Of course, you can learn something from every game. I mean, like I said, I think the coach that you do is a bad day to have a bad day. So, I mean, uh, obviously try to put it behind us. And, uh, obviously, uh, look, look for some, uh, look something forward into the season, next season, the whole season. We did with the another no game, but I mean, obviously, like I said, you don't want to lose. But uh, there's always something to come in. Is that the best defense you faced? Is their defense is that the best one that you faced? Uh, I mean, they're a good defense. They're a great team. Um, we just had a bad shoot night. Uh, but that's credit to them. I think we were one from 19, from three or something like that. But uh, they're a really good team, and they wouldn't be here if they weren't. So, uh, credit to them for sure. Did they do anything defensively, I guess, to take you guys out of the three-point shooting? Or? Uh, we had a lot of open looks. I mean, a lot of them didn't go in. Um, I mean, it happens. I'm going to just use a quote. It was a bad day to have a bad day. Um, but they're a good team as well. Like I just told him, we wouldn't be, they wouldn't be here if they weren't. So. 31 season. Is that something that Coach Beeline told you guys? Yeah, yeah well, I think 17 to notice right this season. Yeah. Like, that's a like Michigan record or something yep. like that. So, um, <clears throat> obviously, I think he just said, there's going to be a team who wins the NIT, there's going to be a team who wins the NCAA tournament. If not, everybody else is going to be in tears. They're gonna, their season's going to be on. Uh, I mean, so, right now, like I just said, right now in this current moment is, uh, it's tough. It's hard. You know what I'm saying? We're kids. We're growing up, and we obviously want to play basketball as long as we can. But I'm saying in a couple of days, tomorrow, tonight, you know what I'm saying we'll definitely look with the team. But had a 17 and no start. Who does that? You know what I'm saying? Had 31 season, back to back. So um, just, it's amazing. And so a few days from now, you might be looking at potentially everybody comes back. Right. How significant is that? Most teams don't. Yeah. Really have that. I mean, we're young. We never do something like this with the young team. Um, and obviously, there's a lot of hope, a lot of hope. It's a bright future. So, um, it's definitely something to look forward to. A lot of young guys being able to get the opportunity next year. Um, I was in their shoes last year, and I think I was able to have a pretty successful year. Um, now it's time to just step up and everybody on the ball. So, I mean, this definitely gives us fuel. And, um, that's definitely something to look into in all season.